as an avid Sex in the City fan, Ryan has said that at his best, right turn alert, uh, he's a Miranda, and at his worst, he's a Carrie, but now I want him to dive headfirst into Housewives, a la Lexi Featherston. If you know, you know. It's time for Bravo. No, they didn't. <coughs> Let's start with Ultimate Girls Trip. Whose side were you on during their blow up about Tamara breaking house rules, Tamara or Dorinda? Tamara, honey, it's not the Stanford prison experiment, okay? Like, <laughs> like let it go. Tamara did point out that Dorinda left the cupcakes in your rooms. Yeah, so. Go ahead. But yeah, I mean, no, she, it's I'm your asking show. You, I mean, well, no, but she also was talking to Brandy while Brandy was eating fruit in her bed. Dorinda was talking right. to her. I was like, oh, again, the rules don't apply to Brandy, as always. Oh, okay. Uh, thoughts on Brandy thinking uh, the chef uh, at Ventford Hall was a lesbian because of her eyebrows. Can you discern someone's sexuality by their uh, eyebrows? Well, I have a unibrow and I like penis, so honestly, I'm breaking the mold a okay. little bit. So I, I feel like, I, I don't know, I feel like no, but I, I understood what she was talking about from that particular case, actually. Um, who knows? Okay. <laughs> case by case situation. Yeah, yeah totally. Um, now, Ryan, who do you think turns the most when she's drunk, Dorinda or Brandy? Well, considering Brandy's never sober, there's nothing to turn. Um, <laughs> and I think Dorinda, well, honey, she's starting. You know what I mean? She's starting. Right. right. Yeah. What, do you, what do you think about that question? I think Dorinda definitely turns more quickly than Brandy. I think Brandy just says stuff because she just doesn't know better. And Dorinda's more serious about the whole thing. I, I think it's interesting. I can't remember what episode we're in right now. Five, maybe. So are you and Brandy at this? Because you and Brandy make a turn, and you kind of wind up OK. Are we supposed to tell people? Well, I don't know. All right. <laughs> um, which of the ex-wives do you think is the thirstiest to get back on their respective show? Well, there is a drought in California, which was caused by Jill Zarin, even though she doesn't live in the state. So. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Beverly Hills, whose side are you on amid their ongoing feud, Sutton or Diana? Honestly, team neither, TBH. However, I do love Diana because she truly does not care. Like, she gives no Fs, and I stand. Uh, oh, reaction oh, my God, are you serious? Wait, <laughs> like, Sutton sounds like, Sutton seems like someone who would get haunted by your own reflection wandering around her, around her house. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> literally, <laughs> woo, woo, woo. You know what I mean? He uh, should be a house fight. Beverly Hills, <laughs> reaction to Erica hitting on one of Garcelle's sons and telling the other to get the F out. Yeah, it's not great. Also, what was not great was Kyle like doubling down and being like, she's fun now. And I'm right. like, if that, if that was Portia, we would be in Lucy Lucy Apple Juicy territory all over again. Right. Um, Kyle doing the splits at parties, always fun or over it? Um, sometimes you have to fill in the gaps in your personality. Ooh! Oh! 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 Okay, right. he Thank really should be a housewife. Thanks for watching. Watch more clips here and subscribe to our channel here. See ya.